What is up designers? My name is William Haddock. You guys can follow me on Twitter at Life of a Will. Also make sure to follow the GFX Twitter. We're doing a lot of awesome stuff on there, giving a lot of stuff away. But today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to kind of do some awesome cool text effects. Uh, it's only in one specific thing under uh, your text here. So let's go ahead and, and you make this kind of style right here, the you know Elite Athletic, which is a you can follow them on Twitter actually, Elite Athletic Gear. Um, they're a uh, company that I'm starting to do a couple t-shirt designs for, and this is actually a lot of the designs that I uh, let's see where they're at there that I am uh, making for them. And uh, let's actually just kind of go in here. Let's create some new text here. Also, another question that I get often is where I get my fonts, and 95% of the time I get my fonts from uh, Defont.com, and then the other like 5% are ones that I pay for, and that I get off you know other font sites. Uh, but you can just type fonts and you, it's pretty easy to find. So let's actually, this is a font called Babas Muve, free on defont.com. And let's go Will, uh, or William Haddock, EST1996. Alright, so we're going to kind of do the same kind of style that we did with this Elite Athletics here. And it's really easy, it's a really cool style to uh, play with here. And uh, all you want to do is with your uh, text layer selected, go to select, go to... Oh my bad, not select, type, my bad, complete, uh, type and then wrap text, and then here you have a ton of awesome styles that you have, you have arc, uh, arc lower, arc upper, arch, uh, bold, shell lower, shell upper, flag, wave, flash, rise, fish eye, inflate, squeeze, and twist, uh, the one that I specifically used in uh, this uh, text right here was the arch, and so let's go ahead and wrap text, and then we're going to go to arch, and then it's going to kind of overdo it at first, but you can then just kind of Play with it until it reaches the uh, exact one or the exact specification that you want it to uh, have or look. And this one right here uh, kind of exactly uh, matches the style uh, right here. Um, pretty uh, on point there, but there's a lot of other really cool stuff that you can do here. Say like the upper arc here, and you can you know bring it up, bring it down, even do a reverse effect, uh, and then you have a lot of different options. You like your horizontal uh, just distortion and then your vertical I mean there's a lot of really cool stuff that you can do uh, with this kind of uh, text here and uh, flag I mean there's just a lot of generally really awesome stuff that you can do uh, within this and it's just it's definitely something that if you guys if I were you guys I would uh, play around with so uh, I want to thank you guys uh, for watching hope you guys learned something in this video it took me for like a couple years to figure that out um, and I've been doing graphics for almost six years now, so it, it, that was one of the things where I didn't figure that out till like my third or fourth year in a graphic design, uh, which is something I definitely wish I learned earlier. So I hope you guys uh, learned a little bit of something, and I hope it works out for you guys. So again, my name is William uh, Haddock. You guys can follow me on Twitter at Life of a Will. Also, make sure to follow me on or follow the GFX Twitter at GFXMCN. And you guys are awesome. Go mad designers.